on. And as you can see today, I decided to match my face with my sweater. And I don't know why my face is this color. I swear I stayed home. I just went for some grocery, but that's it. Today, actually, I want to take you nearby here. It, this is the uh, Cathedral of Erice, which is a small town uh, on the top of a mountain, which is called Monte Erice. And I've been there a couple of times. And I think I've been twice to do some trekking there which is probably a way of seeing it that no no one in uh, Trapani has seen it, <laughs> almost. And this is a dome and it's from the 14th century and it was built uh, from the uh, King of Spain that came here to run away from the revolution that was taking place in Spain. And he received such a great hospitality in uh, Erice that he decided to give them this. Well, of course, the original one is straight up, it's just that it's too high and in such a small square that you cannot draw it um, without this fisheye perspective, which I think... I'm really enjoying this perspective, what do you think? As you can see, the dome is really, really easy. I try to put it like this. It's really simple and it's a Gothic style uh, with a mix of Norman. So it's really linear, really solid, and I love it. It's just so powerful and spiritual at the same time. And it's, I don't know, it gives you this sensation of really connected with something that is higher. And the sky was like that. It was a crazy, windy, cloudy, sunny, it's, it was a great day to go climbing there. The climb is pretty tough, I really enjoyed it, I really needed time in the mountain and from there I think I discovered I really really connect much more with myself uh, when I walk and I definitely want to do a lot more when I get out of quarantine. And I was thinking to just tell you something about this period we are living in. I'm having my art and I was thinking that for me it's not so much different from before because I was still working at home and staying at home. So for me it's, it's easy, let's say. But more than easy is just that I accepted it. It's just something that happened. I just do whatever I can to stay positive, to be um, be home and do go on with my project, having a big vision and knowing where I want to arrive when I get out. So one thing that I want to suggest you is to let go of all the negativity that you can read around and see everywhere right now and uh, just focus and be with yourself and review your 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 goals your vision your mission what do you want to do in this planet what are the things that you love doing and reconnect with them you have the time now and don't waste it just um don't waste this time i think it's an opportunity i don't want to um I put it down. I don't want to say this is uh, not a very bad period and I'm really near to all the people that are working so hard for making us get out of this situation. I'm really near to all the victims, all the families, but from my point of view, the only way to really give a reason to what is happening is to be able to get out better and stronger and the time with ourselves is not a nightmare it's a time it's an opportunity so i really really want to suggest you to take this time to disconnect with everyone that is telling you that is so bad that is boring that is uh that is gonna be so bad when it's finished it's not like that it's the present that is important now everything is going okay and if we allow it if 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 we allow ourselves to see that everything is going okay just 
try to see the beauty in this and you will see that everything is gonna change your emotions are gonna change and you can take charge of those emotions don't let the situation overpower you so i don't know if it's my place to say something like this but it's something i discovered so i just wanted to share it if you want to do art do art if you want to do some gymnastic do some gymnastic at home it doesn't need to go route running if you want to you you have time to listen to video documentaries read all the books that are there and you have never had the time um say with your family if you're home with somebody just pay attention to the connection you can have because that's something that you can really really enjoy and you can really really bring power to that so it's all for today from trapani and from sicily i see you tomorrow and uh, i will bring you to some other beautiful place i still have to decide so i hope you liked the, this video i really hope you en enjoy the time we spent together and uh, i look forward to see you tomorrow i really really would appreciate if you just write me a note just so that i don't feel alone i'm alone already so don't let me feel alone in my <laughs> digital presence too and i see you on uh, youtube facebook or instagram and i wish you a great saturday a great weekend even if now it's not really uh <laughs> which day is today uh, but i wish you a great weekend and uh, stay positive really stay positive that's the only thing you can do right now stay home and stay positive big hug <laughs>